Uh, so we are here in uh, the Junior Under-21 Table Championship going on right now in Plovdiv, Bulgaria. So I'm here joined by with uh, Cem, who is a very strong Turkish international master and also he's quite famous in Liches, known as uh, the Satranj YouTube. And uh, they do lots of fun stuff and uh, Cem also plays a lot on Liches. We have seen him quite a few times. So um, how's the game today, Cem? Would you like to speak about yeah. it? Okay, today I lost the game, but I mean, I learned much, I think. This was, I, I didn't prepare, I mean, I wasn't expecting the, my opponent, Inian. Uh, he played, I mean, very fast and yeah, I was just, it was just not my day. Yeah. So uh, overall, like, uh, how, how the tournament has been so far? Okay, I think it was a good tournament, but it's not going well for me. Uh, but I, uh, I have lack of practice, so you know I'm just getting more used to play, and I think it will be better in the future. So after this, uh, do you have anything planned out, like any next tournament or something, maybe, uh, or just going back to Turkey after this tournament? Yeah, I, I will go to my home, but uh, after one month, or I don't remember the exact exact date, but in November I will play for the Turkish national uh, team. Uh, European team chess championship. Mm, yeah, in, in Slovenia. Yeah, in Slovenia. Okay, yeah. So mostly like uh, we, I'm also going to be there, so maybe we will yeah, speak again. Yeah, but so um, where where do you live, by the way, in Izmir. Turkey? Izmir. Izmir. Ah, beautiful city. It's, it's the west side. The west, west side of Turkey. Okay. And uh, who is your favorite Turkish chess player? <laughs> okay, this is one of the. I mean, this is a very difficult question. Um, I could say two names, uh, Wahab Chanal and Mustafa Yilmaz, and I can't choose one of them, but they are my favorites. And uh, how, uh, like, have you ever been in uh, Bulgaria before, or Plovdiv, any before? Yeah, in Albena, I was in 10 years ago, I think, in 2011. But actually, it was my first, you know, uh, abort tournament, let's say. So. Uh, abroad, sorry. Uh, yeah, but this country is nice because it's very you know, near to Turkey, and yeah, and the weather is. I mean, everything looks good. And uh, what uh, do you like sometimes uh, you do uh, when you're not in a tournament or you're in home? So any activities that you like to share? <laughs> okay, uh, I play FIFA, let's say uh, PlayStation, but sometimes I also you know streaming and some computer games but not much because I I also go to the university so I don't have too much time for these you know uh, activities but yeah sometimes I also play football um, yeah I think that's all so uh, what are you studying right now uh, management information systems it's like computer and economy mixed yeah. Okay, so uh, like, do you plan on pursuing chess more? Like in future, you are <laughs> trying to make it a career, or just focus on study? What will you do? Okay, probably it's chess because I love the game so much. So, um, but I, you know, I want to have the diploma, and you know, when you go to the university, you get different cultures and different people. So, um, I think it's a positive way to my chess. Mm -hmm. Right, okay. Um, so, as you said, the tournament not been so good for you so far, but I wish you good luck for your, the Turkey team and uh, Slovenia for the European teams. And one last question that I've been asking everyone, uh, it will be good to hear yours. So, what is the thing, like, uh, the best thing that you got as a chess player? You played chess and you achieved that, or like, what in life that has... Like, you mean had? the result or...? I mean, the benefit of it. Uh, I mean, anything that you got by playing chess. Maybe you couldn't have got it uh, if you hadn't played chess. What will be that thing? Um, okay, if I speak as a result, uh, I, I got the GM norm. That was the, my best I mean, uh, result, let's say. But, you know, I can, I think, I think that I can, um, when I play chess, like, I feel like myself. But I mean, I don't know if I can do all the time while doing other things. So I can um, yeah, it's just me while playing. So. And uh, one one last question that. Uh, 
um, sometimes like our tournaments don't really go well and uh, how like you're a professional chess player so how do you relax yourself how you uh, come like overcome with the bad result uh, would you like to maybe give yeah. some viewers okay I have many friends that after bad tournament like they you know their ambitions is gone so but it's the opposite for me like I I'm looking forward to you know um, find my mistakes during this tournament so I will analyze them and I will become a better player so I mean actually a bad tournament means I mean I can learn much more in a bad tournament Okay, that's very lovely. Okay, uh, thank you, Jem, again for speaking to us, and uh, good luck for tomorrow and uh, for the future tournament. Thank you. Thank you.